my absence for the last two, three, four days, however long it's been, I, um, I've actually been in the doctor's office more often than I've been at work. But I'm going to try to get out and do two, three calls, do what I can, and take y'all along with me. So, here we go. upstairs. Two ton air handler.
saved a little bit of ground. take my gauges off and this happens. Alright, I thought I might explain a little bit because I didn't talk. It was with the condenser going in my fan blowing on me. I know it's kind of loud. That thing lost most of it's Freon. So I went ahead and charged with 422B. It, this turned into a, instead of replacement, let's try to get it going and get it to last maybe another year or so. I added leak stop because I thought possibly there might be a leak upstairs. It's hard to tell with that leak detector I've got. And I have two Schraders just pouring Freon. I think those were my major problems but it is on in cooling. In fact, it's doing really good. I got a nice temp drop on it. I don't know if I showed, but her filter is over the staircase. I, there's no way to put up a ladder on just an awful place to put one. But um, that's the first one. We got like four or five more to do. <clears throat> All right, guys, on this one, I diagnosed stiff bearings actually last week but I looked at the shaft and it looked like I may not be able to get it off so I went and picked up a blade to go with it
Let's see, we need to put it on that way. So. These have come loose. hammer that one down just like I did the other one. That's enough. Shows it the way I got it, so I'm gonna try to put these in here. Now, if the rotation's wrong, I'm gonna be cussing when I have to pull this back apart.
too hard because my crimping has actually cut those in half. <clears throat> Alright, let's check rotation. Rotation is correct. Alright guys, we're back in here and I'm fixing to clean some of that up so we can start sealing this return.
before I clean this up. Check this out. No, I was really sucking through the filter. No, nope, this one. Y'all see that Delta T on that? It was 10 and 12. That is just a little bit high, but it's a lot different. And 16.7 in here, 17.7. I think we fixed our problem. On that last one, once my temperature probes acclimated a little bit, the temp drop fell from around 19 to 14 or 15 which around here might be good enough but it's not very efficient which means we might have to go back and search for additional problems but before the temp drop was 10 or 12 so at least we're doing a little bit better <laughs> 